Hey everybody, I don't have a chance to bring you really good stories about technology. I think this one actually hits the mark for something that's really awesome. Um, company in Canada is getting a U.S. patent for a space elevator. So after years and years and years and years and years and years of them talking about this, folks, they're finally going to put this thing into action. What a space elevator is, is it's a transportation elevator that goes up and it allows basically people supplies etc to go into atmosphere let's say okay 85,000 I think is a separation between um, uh, our atmosphere and space so let's say it's 75,000 feet high which is enormous but let's say let's say they can do it and so this is the story here. Let's come out of physics.org. All right. So basically, I'm just trying to figure out where this is. So this came out of a space elevator conference 2015, which takes place in Seattle. I'm not going to read any of the major things, but basically they're talking about moving 10 pound or 10 tons of payload and, you know, using gravity loads and everything else to reduce cost. Um, here we go. Now a Canadian company, uh, Thoth Technology in Ontario, has a patent for space elevator to access space. It'll reach uh, 20 kilometers or 12 miles above the Earth. Um, its engineer said the technology could save more than 30% of the fuel of a conventional rocket spacecraft. People could be lifted to a level in the atmosphere requiring less force to launch. Uh, I'm not seeing the name of the co Oh, here, here it is. Uh, GCR, Global Construction Review News. Oh, that's a news. My bad. Trying to figure out where it says the uh, company name. I know they said Thoth and uh, Thoth Technology in Ontario. I understand that, but they have to have um, a building company. And I was wondering who their building contractor was, and it, it's not actually said. All right, so you see this here. Um, the patent does not say the elevator could be scaled to reach 200 kilometers, but it's, but that's a little like saying that your bank balance could be scaled to reach a billion. It's technically true, but the execution may prove tricky. So, basically here, folks, this is a good thing. This is one more step in the right direction. Uh, this is going to move Canada into the space race a thousand times better. Um, I wanted to go into what Thoth was or who he was because um, depending on who you talk to, he was either a real guy or he was a legendary deity, but I believe he was a real guy. Um, what he was, more or less from what I understand is he was a guy that was like Socrates, like all these others, but like 10,000 years before them, basically in the Egyptian era. Uh, he was spotted in several other locations, basically helping out with technology, doing this, doing that. Um, but what he really did was kind of bring civilization to balance after an atrocity, basically like... Uh, any of the big humanitarian projects or companies we have today. And Thoth actually brought the Egyptians and the various other civilizations to the level of power that they were before initially, you know, they collapsed or whatever. I don't know the details, but this is actually pretty good. Thanks, guys. God bless.